speak of it like a Venus flytrap, luring in those lost with familiarity. Familiarity. Oh my gosh. Familiarity. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is embarrassing. <laughs> Hello everybody, it's Mommy here. Welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to be playing a little game from HIO. It's called Little Red Memories. So Little Red Memories, this is about a girl named Bonnie who you see in the middle here. She's currently struggling with something and she gets trapped in a world like a parallel universe a bit of a trigger warning this blood traumatic events um most likely ptsd so without further ado let's go ahead and go into the game i'm so excited just a warning i didn't realize how loud my keyboard is in the video so i apologize about that bonnie Ooh, no matter what, I promise I won't let anything happen to you. Ooh, dang, we all fight that. There's a clock here. You were too late. Oh no. Oh no, what's happening? <gasps> Not my eyes watering already. This is all your fault. Oh, I... It was just that dream again. That horrible, horrible dream. I should get ready and find Hunter. He must have woken up early. Girl... Hunter's probably in the kitchen. I should check there first. We starting off like that? Jeez. These are recipe, but specializing in sweets. Hunter recently bought them for us both to try out. Oh, that's cute. Oh, sweet Ben, how I love the same. The sky is very green and cloudy. I wonder if it'll rain soon. I love rainy weather. It's perfect for coloring up and drinking hot cocoa. Facts. It's a dresser with an array of men and women's clothing. Inside one of the drawers is a collection of beautiful bowls I've gotten over the years. Should I take a few with me? Yes. No harm in emergency accessories. You got fancy bowls. Ooh. Lovely plants. Ooh. Save it. Main entrance. Are we living in a mansion? Okay, off the bed. This is like completely elegant and I feel so royal. I think this is the main entrance. Yeah. I would guess that the kitchen is this way. Okay, dining room. We're getting closer. An empty fireplace. Kitchen. Oh! Hello! Bonnie, you're awake. Good morning, my dear. Good morning! Oh! <laughs> Good morning, Hunter. My sincerest apologies. I wasn't there to greet you sooner. I was hoping to surprise you with breakfast in bed. <laughs> oh, you're too kind, really. What? Is something the matter, sweetheart? You sound off. She had a bad dream. Are you feeling ill? I can fetch you some medicine, if so. <laughs> no, no, it's nothing like that. I just... Was it the nightmare again? Yes. Yeah, the same one. Oh, my sweet Bonnie. I'm so, so sorry. If I was having dreams like that, I I would be upset too. It's okay. I just wish it would stop. I've had the same dream every night ever since I moved in here. At this point, I'm just trying to shake it off as fast as I can. But I'd be lying if I said it didn't affect me a lot. 
well, please just remember that it's just a dream and it can't hurt you. I'm always here if you need to talk about it, but I know it's a touchy subject. Here, I know what will cheer you up. After I'm done preparing breakfast, I'll be all yours for the rest of the day. Maybe we could continue reading that book you like so much together? Yes. Or would going on a nice picnic in a forest be more pleasant? Yes. Haha, <laughs> choices, choices. Anything you could think of, my sweet bunny, and we will do it in a heartbeat. Oh. Hunter. Hehe, <laughs> thank you. That all sounds so lovely and so hard to decide. If it were up to me, I would pick the picnic. Well, no, actually, it did say that it was gloomy earlier. Well, you have lots of time to think it over, my dear. Just say the word when you've decided what you like to do. I would do anything to make my darling happy. Oh. Hunter's right, it's just a dream. It's not real, it can't hurt me. Mm, well, dreams are messages. Bruh. My eyes are watery. But then, why can't I stop shaking? Why well, does it feel like I'm seconds away from death at all moments? Mm-mm. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, my eyes are watery. It still feels real. No matter how many distresses I give myself, I'm always forced to remember it. I'm guessing the traumatic event she went through in her life. Oh God, what's going on? How, how long have I been walking? You're in a loop, sweetie. Ooh! Oh God. Oh no. Am I hallucinating? Everything looks awfully strange. What was that? Eek, what was that? I don't want to find out. Ooh. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Wolf spider. You. I gotta get out of here now. Woo! Oh! Caught in the spider's grasp, so you meet your painful demise. Special death one out of three, parole. <laughs> oh my god. I knew what I should have saved. I knew I should have saved again. Run! I hate being chased. Oh, go! Oh! Oh! <laughs> no! Okay. So I don't have to worry about the gaps. I don't like that you're catching up to me, though. Who's that? What is this place? Am I still asleep? Um, pinch yourself. Ouch! Well, I think that worked. No, I'm definitely awake. Yep. The windows are boarded up. Try to peek through them. You see nothing but pitch black outside. Yeah, I'm definitely nervous now. A blood so side table. The blood looks new. I wonder who was down here. An array of books stack the shelves. Nothing of interest stands out to you. Okay, I'm gonna save again. I hear whispering. Make the right side look like the left side. Okay. Rip the painting? Yes. Sorry, beautiful painting. Um, okay, what's next? This one needs to be moved. And am I missing something? Oh, okay. Turn this one. Okay. Um, what else am I missing? Is that it? 
the door unlocked. <laughs> okay, so I appreciate the multiple saves because you never know what to expect in these types of games. There's a fish up here? Hey, psst, up here. Do you have any food on you? I'm hungry, so hungry. I want something meaty. Oh no, get away from me. Red flags. There's nothing out there. Do you want to try and get closer to see better? No. <laughs> no, thank you. So I'm thinking I probably have to find something for the fish. Oh, something is inside the pot. You got a garden shovel. Hmm. What about this one? A potted plant. Oh, there's another door here. Um, I want to save again. <laughs> okay. There seems to be small fish swimming around in the pond. Would you like to try and catch one? Yes. You plunge your hand into the water. She's gonna die. I knew it. <laughs> the fish has sharper teeth than you thought. There's a book labeled question for Bonnie. Hello, Miss Bonnie. I'd like to get to know you better. Out of these options, which is your favorite color? Um, I'm gonna say red. Ah, red is it? I had a feeling you would choose that one. A book labeled The Parallel Volume 2. Read it. A great philosopher once compared the earth to a great big living being, and us merely bacteria inside of it. The parallel works similarly this way to this in a way. So are we in the parallel? This world is alive just as much as any creature, and the more food it gets, the more stable it becomes. It feeds on your fear. Oh, that sucks. It changes to suit the hardships of those around it, and it only seems to lure in those who have faced immense tragedy with it with uh <laughs> within their life. Think of it like a Venus flytrap, luring in those lost with familiarity. Familiarity. Oh my gosh. Familiarity. Oh. <laughs> 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 this is embarrassing. <laughs> Before subjecting them to torment and eating them whole. An empty shelf. Wait. Upon further inspection, there's an old net on one of the shelves. Okay, so I'm guessing that we have that now. Yes. So now we can catch a fish. Um, yes, use old net. You plunge the old net into the water. You caught a small fish. Yay! Hey, psst, up here. Yes, give small fish. Food, food! The fish gobble up the smaller fish with ease. Thank you. Take this. You got Pirate Room Key. Thank you. Okay, so I'm guessing that we can go into the other door now. So I'm gonna save. Unlock the door with the Pirate Room Key. No, thank you. <laughs> A book laid with the Parallel Volume 3. Read it. The front doors of this place have only opened once during the time I spent here. Who? There is a man who went through each room of the house, collecting a variety of strange crystal shards along the way. Presenting the door with these shards seemed to please the house, letting the man go forward. I must conduct further research as to the meaning of these shards and their connection to the parallel. Oh, this is so cute, but in a slightly creepy sense that kind of resemble me way. Yeah, now that I'm thinking about it. A strawberry cake, it looks delicious. Should I cut it with the garden shovel? I'm gonna say no, because I feel like she's gonna die. <laughs> um, okay. Okay, now I really feel like she's gonna die. Okay, so I could cut it. 
and I'm gonna say no. A room key, nice. Okay, parallel eastern hallway. So I'm pretty sure like something like this would have multiple endings. Where is this? Ah, uh, it seems we have another arrival. Another? That dreadful wolf spider appeared not too long ago. And now it seems we have a bunny in our midst. Although you don't seem much like the others. You're alive, are you not? Yes. I, um, yes. Where am I? Who are you? My, so many questions. I like that. I would have a lot of questions too. <laughs> my name is Carnation. What might I call you, my dear? My my name is Bonnie. Well, Miss Bonnie, welcome to hell. <gasps> so straightforward. Bruh. <laughs> I'm only teasing. Right now you're in a place called the parallel. A world in between life and death, parallel to the one you came from. That sucks. It seems you may have lost your way and have gotten stuck here. You look so young too, what a pity. Stuck here? So there's no way I can go back home? No need to fret. This world is dangerous, especially for a small thing just such as yourself. Yeah, I'd be happy to assist you in returning to your world. If you want to return to the world, to the normal world, all you have to do is simply touch this flower. Oh, well, that's easy. Ah, oh, thank you so much. I really just want to go home. Wait, just a moment. I knew it was, it's not that gonna be that easy. You must know first that this is only a temporary solution. Oh. Also, the parallel works quite differently compared to the other worlds. Once it's had a taste of you, it won't so easily let you go. In other words, this world will always try to suck you back in, even upon returning to normality. So the parallel thinks that it's entitled to keeping me there? However, I believe there is a way to get rid of this world's grasp on you for good. Is that facing her trauma? Come with me. Here, these were left for you from the room you just came out of. You got Daciana's shards. Crystal shards? That book was talking about crystal shards. Whenever you complete your challenge in one of these rooms, there's a chance you'll find a few crystal shards. The front doors to this house are locked. However, when presented with enough shards, the doors will open. There's your ticket out of this world. Thank you, but why crystal shards? These aren't normal crystal shards, my dear. They're made of hopes, thoughts, dreams, and fears. I like to call them memory shards. Powerful emotions go into each one, which is akin to a feast to the parallel. Just put the ones you find on the tables in the main room, and soon enough you'll be out of here for good. Mm. Now, I will be in this room if you need further assistance. Be careful, Miss Bonnie. I am so confused. Am I losing my mind? I'll just pretend like I fully understood everything that just happened. Yep, this is all. Totally normal. Poor Bonbon. Bon. Many scientific books can be found on the shelf. Many seem to take a more supernatural turn, however. Um, is there a book where I can save? Probably outside? Yes. Oh, garbage scary. The rats, I can hear them. They're hungry in the other world. Miss, if you feed them, I have something that might be useful to you. 
some shards. Well, all right, you guys, that's going to be it for today's episode of Little Red Memories. I'm actually enjoying this story so far. It's really unique, and I like how they just put you in, and it's so engaging right away. Definitely looking forward to making a series on the channel regarding this game. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you leave a like down below, and also comment down below your theories of the outcomes of this game i'm definitely getting like horse party vibes um i feel like there's a bit of similarity in that being in parallel worlds if you haven't already make sure you click the subscribe button and click the bell so you get notified of every time i upload until next time bye guys hey guys how you doing hello hopefully your day's not broken see me i'm in here grooving Jazz flow, the mood is so soon. They ain't know I'm wrapped the eye.